Hey everybody! Carbase is we welcome. We're going to do the uh, 2019 Bowman Jumbo number 15 Rip City Cards style. Come this way. Get this out of the way. Here's your case. Take our poster and put it in our poster pile. Hoping I can uh, send those posters back to Tops for uh, some kind of uh, like wrapper redemption, but nicer maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. And I got top loaders. I got sleeves. I think we're good. Box by box, just because. Not in any uh, any staggering rush for this. Okay, chromes, inserts, papers, chromes, papers. Papers, chromes, a uh, Matthias for the Royals. Nice card. I'm imagining uh, now. All of a sudden, I realize you want to see who you who you have. Probably. So I will make that a reality. Nice refractor auto for the uh, Royals. And a filler team at that. Which should show which should show you the initial and ultimate value of a filler. Dude, I already told Gelf, like, nobody's going to pick Jesse for a jury. I got stuck with it one time. A uh, Sean Murphy to 125. I didn't think it would pick me because I thought that, I, that you know, that, I, mean, at the time, I mean, I was, I don't know, this was 10 years ago, maybe. But they picked me. A uh, Mason Martin Sparkle, the two ninety nine for the Pirates autograph. It ended up being some like I don't. It's still like a little bit unclear whether it was like a drug deal gone wrong, or like a shakedown robbery kind of thing gone wrong. I don't know. We ended up convicting the dude, but it it it, it took like four days of my life. Keegan Thompson autograph for the Cubs. I got a certificate for uh, for doing it that I think I still have somewhere. An atomic uh, talent pipeline for the Indians. Ooh. That's no fun, Aussie Jim. And Austin Riley to 250 for the Braves. I don't know. I was more interested. Sadly, DJ Stewart to Purple Paper to 250. And a uh, Greater All Twins Paper to 250. They left all of the uh, evidence, like in in our room, 
So we got we got I got to look at uh, bags of uh, cocaine and uh, weed. It was, it was bad weed though. You know, for our deliberations. Well, I mean, is it possible that he was, in fact, innocent? And we have, like, a lot of cases here that's, uh, like, juries just decide, like, with or without evidence that uh, somebody is guilty. And they just say, screw it. See, I don't know. To me, honestly, Jim, that would be, like, just the worst possible thing. Because, like, for someone to do that is the worst, I mean, it's, like, rape, animal abuse, murder. Like, I think in that order for me. But, I mean, if that guy, if he didn't do it, the life impact would just be staggering. No, I mean, I was, I was kind of lucky that, like, at the end of the trial... Like the like the prosecutors and stuff came up to us and were like, oh, you know, like you know, thank you for you know, thank you for doing you know doing this or whatever. These are the things that we couldn't tell you during the trial, and it was all like, I mean, he had been he like he was in the military and had been bounced out for like you know beating somebody. Like, I mean, it, it was it was bad. Like, I mean. The guy was not good, but for whatever reason, like there was just stuff that they couldn't couldn't be said during trial, but could be told to us after it was over. Which made oh redemption. It's either Kikuchi or the Dodger young blood, or it could be uh, some kind of buyback too, also. A Chrome Prospect Auto. Oh, so it's it's uh, the Dodger dude. It kind of went away quickly once I saw the uh, prospect because that meant that it had to be him. If it was a rookie, could have been Kiku or would have been Kikuchi, and then otherwise it is what it is. Yeah, I don't, I mean, I personally don't mind the jury duty. Like, I, I kind of just feel like it's something that you got to do. You know? I mean, I knew I knew a guy that, uh, like, you know, told me one time, like, oh, you know, I went into jury duty. I, and he immediately just started telling people, like, oh, you know, I don't, I don't like the blacks, I don't like the Jews, I don't like the Mexicans, I don't like anybody. And, like, the, the judge kind of caught wind of it and was like, you know what, I clearly see you're just trying to get out of this. A real bear to uh, 125. I'm just going to go ahead and have you sit here for three days and kept the dude... Yeah, no, Bergie. He that's the that's the only card he has. It's the only card he has. He he made him show up for the next three days of jury duty and just and just sat him in the in the waiting room for for actively trying to get out of jury duty. Again, I don't mind it. Oh, hey, Bryce Wilson. Top 100, number 58 for the Braves.
Dom Thompson Williams for the Yankees refractor autograph. Are you like how required are you to go, Aussie Jim and Greg? Because unless unless it's a uh, federale, like they don't like if you don't show up, it's not like a huge deal uh, to last to one fifty. Like I mean, there's a lot of people I know that just take the summons and just like throw it straight in the trash and just just don't even go. It's not a big deal. Now, federal. There's a whole nother deal. The wife had to do like two months of federal. A Brock Burke uh, to 150 Blue Shimmer. Federal duty. JoJo, uh, Phillies to 150. Yeah, I think I've been called twice. Once, like I like you have to call like a phone number like the day before you're supposed to go, and they tell you whether to show up or not. And once they just said don't show up, and the second time I showed up and had to serve. I mean, the only thing that like half sucked was I still got. I mean, I well, I didn't even get paid from work because I was hourly, and like they pay you to be a jury duty, but they pay you, let's say, like ten dollars a day to, to do jury duty. The parking, the juror parking, is ten dollars a day for juror parking. So it's it's like it's just a, it was just a straight a straight screw all the way around. I don't know, cause the bone, like the the Sterlings, are on cards. Like I don't know why the uh, top fifties are stickers, or top top one hundreds are stickers. It's weird. It's weird. Uh, Franco to 499 Phillies. A uh, Evan White Mariners to I mean, they're usually because it's like an old card that did it. You know, I mean, like the like the they did it back in the day before there was autographs. They would just like print them on there. A hey, uh, Quantrill uh, to four ninety nine refractor for the uh, Padres. It was only only because it was like that back in the day. Sparkle for uh, Izzy Wilson of the uh, Bravos. Hate on the uh, old timers for that, as I as I hate on all old timers 
for uh, all of baseball's uh, ills. Fado, uh, to uh, one fifty for the Tigers. I think they need to get rid of the uh, get rid of an umpire for uh, balls and strikes. A Ruiz refractor autograph for the Padres. Get a get a machine to do it to call balls and strikes. Leave them there to handle uh, home plate action, but just let balls and strikes go to a machine. Stop batters from uh, stepping out of the box. Every single time a pitch is thrown, like just, you know, hone in and do your job. Don't step out, reset. Cut a game. If you can cut a, if you can cut a baseball game down to under an hour and a half, I might be willing to watch it. And for the Dodgers, the Santana. Dodgers uh, double up winning on this one so far. But we're not even halfway through. So many amazing autographs and cards to be had. Just got to get the base out my way. Get the chrome out my way. Get the inserts out of my way. Nobody goes to games anyway, Greg. That's the problem. Nobody goes to games anyway. I mean, if, if you want to affect that in some way, then put uh, put sports gambling into the stadium so that after you're like done watching the game that you didn't really care about, you can then sit there and. Uh, Drink a little bit while you bet on some other games. And, I mean, if, if you start early and start right, I mean, you should be able to get... I mean, 12 beers down easy in an hour and a half. I mean, that's... If you're not drinking that fast, then you're then you're not drinking right. Or open the stadium up an hour and a half early for like entertainment, like local, uh, you know, local kids singing or you know, dance troops or something, you know, some, something along those lines. There's a thousand ways to go about it. A 30th anniversary card. 30 out of 30. Is that Keebert Ruiz? It is Keebert Ruiz for the Dodgers. Dodgers triple winners now. I don't know how new it is. I don't know how new it is, but I just saw a, a, like a, a, a video of like a cricket, like a pitcher. I don't know if it's called. I don't know if it's like if it's a pitch or what they call. It, but the guy that throws the throws the ball. They like you know, as far for my terminology, struck out the guy, and then he like you know was like yeah you know like you know screaming in uh, awesomeness that he had, that he had done that, 
and like hurt his shoulder. Which I've seen before in American sports, but I just thought it was funny. He got excited and hurt himself. White Sox on the way. A uh, gold Travis Swaggerty to 50. The number 73 top prospect. A bowler. Thank you, Greg. I have watched it occasionally. I don't, I don't watch it as much as I do rugby. Which rugby, I am... A, a, fan of even though I don't a thousand percent understand the rules. And Ornalis uh, Shimmer to 299. Even though I'm not I mean I'm I'm like 85% on the rules but I don't so uh, I don't know them all. But I do but I do like rugby. Another redemption if it's prospecting, let me get this paper out of the way. If it's prospect, then we know already who it is. If it's rookie, then we probably know already who it is. If it's buyback, then it's completely different. Oh, it's a Kikuchi for the Mariners. My first Kikuchi. Nice card, Mariners. Dude, I think this uh, this second uh, second shipment of stuff has been, frankly, a little nicer than the first. I mean, I think like you may want to consider jumping in on the uh, on some of them some of them hobbies. Aussie Jim, whatever they show on ESPN, if you are talking to me. Whatever they show on ESPN on Saturdays around 11. Yeah, we're not even halfway through it, Greg. I'm telling you, I think, I mean, I think this new batch we got has been significantly better than the, than our initial shipment. A Savali for the Indians. A try six, obviously. Uh, Luke and Baker to uh, one twenty five. Because call talker to two fifty. There's a whole lot of like mashing of people and then a ball spitting out of what looks to be like a giant mash of people's butthole basically, which then shifts to one side and somebody runs laterally until the mash occurs again and then that ball spits out of somebody else's butthole and then the movement goes in a different way until they either cross a line and put the ball down or well hang on there was there was some kicking involved in it too but the kick oh no wait yeah 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 the kicking is involved like depending on where you are like where you went through like the goal line again I'm, I'm using a, a, a an american term like then you would like kick from that like from that spot so many yards back like into the you know into the goal post and they would either they would either go like eh, like this or like eh, like that so now i have a, a whole nother thing of rugby to understand league or union
Oh gee, all right now, now I guess I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to fire up YouTube now after after uh, this is over to figure out uh, what the difference is here. Okay, how about t what what is the one that I need to be watching? Tell tell me that. That would make it easier. What do I what do I want to watch? Well, no, I don't even care about like international. Like, what's what's your what's your preference? What's your preference? No, I just, I mean, dude, I mean, it's dude, the people are so big and so strong and so fast. It's just entertaining. I mean, if, if there are like some variations to it. I mean, the fact that they, that they don't wear helmets and are just bashing into each other, it's entertaining all the way around. Like, I don't, I mean, I don't have, I have like a, like, well, you're probably talking to Aussie Jim anyway. All right, I'm going to shut up and do Bowman. I'm gonna not listen to the chat and pull a Cedric Mullins autograph for the Orioles. And again, assume that everybody in the chat is talking to each other and not paying attention to me. Because that's probably the truth. A Darian Cruz Atomic to 100 for the Braves. Well, no, I, I, I sometimes get caught up with uh, like doing what I'm doing, then looking at chat, and then answering whatever statement has popped up in chat. <laughs> yeah, Aussie's taking over. Hashtag Aussie rules. I mean, I guess is basically what, what what the hashtag of this particular break is going to be. Okay, let me ask you this then. So I've already established that I enjoy the rugby. There are very many uh, variations to it, so I can find a variation that I like. Is rug or is uh, is cricket worth my time even looking at? I know of it. I know 25% of the rules of it. A Capel for the Indians autograph. They have not been uh, particularly drawn to it. I just see highlights of uh, like crazy catches or uh, some guy that. Uh, you know, hit, hits like 36 home runs in a uh, in a game kind of deal. Okay, pass on the cricket then. Hard pass on the cricket. Hey, uh, Victor Mesa Jr. Refractor. I will stick to the. Uh, Sports where people hit each other. For some reason, that seems to be where I am drawn to. I did see like a very entertaining video on YouTube one time of a guy that was like a cricket or a, a, a rugby fan watching 
NFL hits. Have you ever seen such a, such a thing? That the guy was just like staggered. A uh, Cole Reagan's the four ninety nine paper of the uh, NFL hits that he was seeing versus what he was used to watching with uh, rugby. A uh, Francisco Arcia to four ninety nine for the Cubs. A uh, Brendan Rodgers two ninety nine sparkles. Yeah, I, you know what? Listen, I mean, my baby has taken, I mean, most of my free time away. So any cricket and or uh, rugby watching would be done at the office between the times of like 4.30 and 5 o'clock. Uh, in, in between me like trying to mentally prepare myself to do this and whatever else I had to do. So... I don't know if there'll be uh, cricket in my uh, in my, in my future. I mean, that's the one thing that I very much liked about rugby that there was like no stoppage. You know, that it just like went and went and went and went and went. You know, whereas like NFL, like a play stops, everybody resets, and they go again. Whereas rugby, like, they, I mean, they were just, you know, it was just like going and going and going and going and going. Let me write it down. It has been written down. Chris Fitz. How you doing? Oh, Gold Shammer. Could we have some ink? Could we have some hot fire ink? Maybe, perhaps. Please. Thank you. A Lion Richardson Reds. Gold Shimmer. I'm still needing at least one massive ray or one massive giant. I would take either at this point right now. Necessito, I mean one or the, one or the other, I think would clear clear me for feeling of this. Jordan, I know, I know. That's listen. I I am not. I am not not focused on it. Another gold. It is a straight Ethan Hankins for the uh, engines. And shimmer style. Come on, Wander. Come out and play with us. Yeah, Bateson pulled it, didn't he? Hey, Kevin Smith to uh, 150 paper. I think Bateson pulled a Luciano. A Blaze Alexander for the Diamondbacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that 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 is Bateson. Yeah, he called me at nine thirty this morning. He had, among other things, he's like, "Oh, did, did, did you hear?" And I'm like, "Hear what?" He's like, "Oh, pulled the Luciano super, and and, and it, he he pulled another super yesterday too. Another super auto yesterday too." 
I can't remember who it was. It's a uh, Andrew Kisner, four ninety nine refractor. It's a uh, Jonathan Duplantier. Four ninety nine. A Sean Murphy uh, blue refract or blue? Yeah, it's a blue refractor to uh, one fifty. All right, two more boxes for a super or a red is what I'm. Uh, Mateo Gill for the Cardinals, base autograph. Is what I is what I'm looking for. What I desire and what I want deeply. This on me. Hey, Casey, how you doing today? All right, so two boxes to pull a Vlad, a Wander, a Bart. And probably if uh, other people had their had their options, like four to five other cards. So we need we really need to make all of these uh, all of these work. A uh, Aidman to four ninety nine for the Cubs. A uh, Atomic uh, to one fifty for Joey Bart. Not good enough as it is not autographed. I really just want one super. I mean, I'm almost at this point. I think the super is going to be in the hobby, though. I just, I've got a feeling that this that the super sits in the hobby. A uh, Medina refractor for the Phillies. And another Eli Morgan for the Indians. Indians and Dodgers. So far doing very well. In the in these uh, particular cases. And a steel walker for the White Sox. Purple refractor autograph to 250. White Sox doing a little bit of business here. So now we're creeping down to one case. Or one box. For a whole lot of love. And a Brave to 
Got a uh, Taylor Widener to 125. It has been rough for some. This is an ugly truth. For right now, though, I'm not done. I'm not done. We will blast the last case. A Brock Burke for the Rays. Refractor autograph. Not the Ray you're looking for. But, I mean, what if he turns into the next uh, Clayton Kershaw? Then that card all of a sudden becomes very exceptionally awesome. He could be that one guy. He could be that one guy. Everybody's like, oh, god damn. I hit a Burke bed. I'm going to throw that in the trash. And then three years from now, I'm like, man, I had a I had a Burke refractor autograph that I sold for two dollars. That thing that thing's worth five thousand bucks right now. What? It's possible. It's possible. That I mean, that is the only reason that I love and I open and I enjoy Bowman because it happens more than you would think every single year. There is some dude that nobody wants, nobody gives a crap about. And then, you know, come two years, three years later, they're like, oh, you know, that that, that one cheap team. I'll <laughs> Bless this last box, Abraham. <laughs> Bless this last box, Abraham. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. To me, Bowman is for holding. Bowman's for hanging on to. You know? I mean, you can throw it away now or you can throw it away later. Why not throw it away later when you don't you know when you don't know if what you got is awesome? A hey, uh, Genesis Cabrera 250. Come on, three more. Three more good ones. Best box that anybody has ever seen. The time is now. The time is now, Bowman. You've been blessed by Abraham. Let us do this. Well, Bryce Harper. Short print for the Phillies. So there is that. A D L Hall to 250 refractor for the Orioles. So even all of our autographs are holding back a little bit. The blue. It's White Sox. It's Steel Walker. White Sox blue and I believe is a purple too. Shenanigans. Well, right. so we've got strong color to begin with. Could we have a three-color box? It's possible. It's possible, even probable. I've seen crazier things. I've seen crazier things. I mean, it's almost too good of a baseball name. It just is Sheffield Refractor Autograph for the Yankees. Rookie Refractor Autograph. He has, what, cards for both the Yankees and the Mariners, I believe? In this? Come on. 
There's one more. One red changes somebody's life. Let's just make it, not even life, let's just call it break. One red changes somebody's break. Let's just find it. And it's a sparkle for uh, Martinez to two ninety nine. That's Blue Jays. Come on, Red. Was not in this one because I didn't see a red initially. Alright, so last pack, I think, autograph. And it is a Jose Suarez for the Angels. Oh, what one? Son of a motherless goat. So, autograph wise, we have got. I mean, that's a numbered card. Got the uh, Suarez for the Angels. A blue Steel Walker. A purple Steel Walker. And Eli Morgan for the Indians. A Mateo for the Cardinals. A Blaze Alexander for the Diamondbacks. A Capel for the Indians. A Cruz Atomic for the Braves. A Mullins Orioles. A Savali Indians. A Coochie for the Mariners. A uh, Kiba Ruiz. 30 out of 30 for the Dodgers. Uh, Santana for the Dodgers. A uh, Ruiz for the Padres Refractor. A uh, Izzy Wilson for the uh, Braves uh, Sparkles. Uh, Don Thompson Williams Refractor. Bryce Wilson Top 150. A uh, Diego Cartea for the Dodgers. Uh, Keegan Thompson Williams. A uh, Mason Martin for the Pirates Sparkle. And a Matthias Refractor for the uh, Royals. And a uh, Lion Richardson Reds. Uh, gold shimmer. Thank you about this route.